everyone and welcome to another video in the monks of all the other videos I'm doing. Basically this is my October palette full pack. I have opened it to basically throw the box away. Um, it's the October one and I haven't even touched it yet. It's a lot of ink obviously. October, Inktober, yes. Oh, fed up of ink yet at all? No. But essentially what I thought I'd do because it's really... shall I bring it over? Ooh, 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 ooh. This is what we got. It's awfully brown and walnutty and kind of has that, I don't know, sepia look to it. And basically, if you see the other videos I've been uploading, I'm doing NaNoWriMo, National Novel Writing Month. And within my book, there is a book that the, both the characters have. And within it, it's just, it's, it's kind of like, it's supposed to be um, a history book, but it's kind of skewed and weird. And I just got an email, be quiet computer. And just has these really weird illustrations. So I thought I would basically, I'm, I'm going to try and draw an evil bunny. I'm going to try and draw an, an evil bunny because this, these colors like walnut ink. There's walnut ink. Can you ink anything? Wal natural walnut coloured. Oh, okay. <laughs> Let's just get a load of walnuts and just squeeze them really hard. Excellent for ink for dipped pens or brush. So there you go. So we got that. I just thought it'd be really good to have a go with this stuff, even though it's a little late for the October one, and see see what happens if I can do this. So anyway, we've got a nice little brush set, and then there is a dip pen for some more of these, which I will hopefully not let go all horrible because I keep leaving them in water. Don't leave them in water, these, because they they um they rust. <clears throat> anyway, we also got a Faber-Castell Pitarsis Artist Brush in again, walnut brown, so they're really going for it with the walnut. We got, this is the watercolour poly, well this is the Polychromo Faber-Castell, and this which I did drop and had to re-sharpen, so hopefully it's not completely broken, but this is a Faber-Castell Oh, old, old brick drawer. It's got a little paintbrush, so it's water soluble. But that's what we have. And then, am I going to do this on this, or am I going to do it in my um, sketchbook? I don't know. So I've got a new sketchbook, and I'm very, very excited about it. But um, so because we've got some drawing paper. Now, is that going to be a dry media? So maybe not ink on this, but it's quite nice, quite thin. So it's definitely, I think, pencil only. That. And then we've got um three sheets of craft 250 GCS G, G, GSM always late in the day for me acid free 100% cotton paper stone stonehenge craft oh paper oh oh I did not notice the color let me in how'd you get in So yeah, there you go, craft paper, paper basically, in a rather fetching brown. I wonder what this looks like on here. Shall we find out? Oh, why not? I have been, um, I've got a new sketchbook, I'm very excited. This is a lectern, lecturum, lecturum, it's one of them. Um, I can't find an Elo sketchbook. There's one on eBay right now for about 50 quid, well, with delivery and no, just no, because you can't get them in England, but I wanted a square notebook that lays flat. So I've got this now and so far it's quite nice. Only if you open it, it does, it will lay flat, which is nice. And the paper seems okay. I've done my tried and tested um, red Copic and if it can take that, it's it's okay. So a little bit of coming through, that's, that's expected, that's fine. Um, and I've started drawing evil bunnies or the hairs really, but as my daughter said, they look more grumpy than than scary. Um, yeah, I basically want, it's kind of elongated and everything is slightly wrong. And for some reason it has a fluff, big fluffy tail rather than a little pom-pom tail. But yeah, that's what I've started on. I like this guy, I don't mind doing this guy. Shall we try that guy on this? Because I didn't realize, what was he told you how close I'd look? I hadn't realized it's this paper. We'll see, we'll try the ink on this and we'll try it on this and we'll see how we go. 
and help him do a, an evil bunny. Good luck, Sam. Yeah, making a bunny look evil. Okay, I've started. Um, I've literally just opened the lid, and this this has happened. So there we go. Ooh, okay, where can I put this? What am I wearing? Oh, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Right, so it's it seems more watery. I don't know, and I know I shouldn't be dipping straight into that. I know, but you know, live dangerously and all that. Oh my. Okay, this is really watery. Normally, when you use this, can you see the little um the little window in there? The little um where the ink is supposed to go. I'll think of the word in a minute. It normally would fill up. You can just see it. A little skin of ink over it there but wow that's that is that is watery that's water as opposed to to ink so that's different this is the bigger nib hello there oh it doesn't last long it's very scratchy very scratchy i'm not sure about this ink now i started this i'm thinking what have i done to myself i can't do it quick you cannot do this quick. What am I doing wrong? Should I just scoop it up and see if I can scoop it up into there? Does that help? Does that make it any better? This is an ear, by the way. Because obviously you can't have a, a tidy, you can't have a tidy evil bunny, you know? You've got to have a bedraggled evil bunny because, you know, evil bunny. Kind of a hair, really, but. For some reason, I've given him some killer cheekbones in this one. And I guess, I, I guess sort of the, the rounder a creature is, in a way, more you know, babyish kind of, um, features that the cuter they are and the more angular the less cute they are i wish i hadn't written hello there on them <laughs> i just cut that off i just cut it off it'll be fine i'm trying to make it really long this this is not working this ink pen look at it i think it's more i mean it's showing a dip pen that it says it's for dip pens but i don't know I just, I don't know, might use the other one. Has it got a smaller cavity isn't the word either. Oh, I'll think of it. What is that word? For when the ink pools, oh, it's gonna annoy me. It's gonna annoy me until I think of it and then I'll go. Mm. But I wonder if that would make it any different. I'm trying to go as slow as I can, but I kind of want it scratchy. It's definitely scratchy. I mean, I like the colour. I like it on this. What's it going to look like on this? Let's just do a little tiny bunny. See, it's a, it goes on a lot easier on this. That's a lot easier. So, never have used craft paper. Not really, not a lot. So, is that a craft paper thing? No, you want little tiny eyes. Big eyes. Oh, cute. Unless you're talking really big bug eyes. But essentially, see, it's really, it's lasting a lot longer on this. Okay, that's weird. Let's do a little, like, bunny-shaped blob. I don't know why. Why have I done a bunny-shaped blob? See, that, that's getting cuter now because you're sort of doing, you know, little tiny feet. And then there's the there's the tail. That's what I'm going with. That's what I've done anyway. But on this paper, I think I'd rather have thicker ink. It seems to be filling up the well. Is it well? Is it well? Is it? No, there's another word I'm thinking of. I may have had the wrong word there, but but yeah, it's it's interesting. I do quite like it now. I'm doing it, but it's difficult to do. If that makes sense. And it's not very. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, oh. Gotta have a huge splodge. Just a huge splodge coming off of it. I don't know if I'm ready for a huge splodge. 
but hmm, interesting, definitely interesting. I have to push it. Oh, okay, let's push a bit harder. I'm scared to push hard, but if we push a bit harder, we can get more, more of a, um, a line. But I don't like pushing harder because it feels like I'm ripping up the paper. just behind this little paw, a big scary paw. If it looks scary yet, it's all going to be in the eyes. You know, we just want, oh, what do I want? Um, oh, there's a motorbike outside, that's always nice. Uh, can we make it kind of grinning a little? I don't know, that looks more saucy now, doesn't it? It looks like a little saucy devil. Maybe if we put his eyes further down, like he's leaning down, you know, that, that classic bad guy staring up the camera kind of thing. How's that? Does that look evil? It looks lopsided. I know that much. It's more kind of human now. <laughs> Have I done a human bunny? I was not aiming for a human bunny. His face is a heck of a lot smaller. Kind of looks alien-esque and oh there's a nice little blob. I'm gonna pretend this is like an old book, uh, an old page out of a book kind of thing. So it's okay if there are like age spots. <laughs> so if I drop any I can just pretend that I meant to do it. It was age spots. This has really got nothing to do with the story I'm writing. It was more to say that this book is kind of unreliable or what they're seeing is unreliable because what they're seeing in this book kind of isn't possible. So it was sort of a vehicle for, for that, just unreliable narrators or, or we're following the unreliable person was was my my idea so you don't really see this bunny kind of see a few creatures and stuff if you're interested whoops see we're just going to pretend we meant to do that we're just going to pretend this ink is so thin I'm, I'm only dipping it in a little bit i don't know that's a problem but or if i'm just going a bit too jolty movements but okay it's just done. Um, I'll tell you what, let's um let's get a paintbrush quickly. Hurry up, paintbrush. Ah. Let's get this little one. If you'd actually come out of the packet, that would be preferable. Right. Do you reckon we could just colour him in? I meant to do this. See? Everything's alright if you just keep going. But yeah, if you are interested in my story, I mean, bear in mind I'm writing it. I'm writing like a couple of different days, but generally about 2,000 words of that one and 2,000 words if I'm writing another one. I'm writing two consecutively because one just wasn't that difficult enough for me. Um, so if you're interested, kind. But at the end of the videos, when I, a couple of days I haven't written anything, but at the end of most of the videos is the story so it's like on for like five seconds a page so if you're interested it's also on Wattpad but I haven't quite figured that out yet I don't know if um Wattpad is more for you know saucy fan fiction or what but it's on there oh wow this is really watery now I quite like it though we got a little brown bunny now did I mean a brown bunny I don't know, but I've got one. So, yeah, you, you go with things, really, don't you? And everything is fine, more or less. But yeah, that, that is what I've been up to. After Inktober, immediately, of course, it's uh, NaNoWriMo because it's in November and oh, December will be, well, December has its own things going on really, doesn't it? Which will be, but personally, we'll, I don't think there's going to be much change for our Christmas 
to be honest, everybody who would be here is kind of in the house, God help me. But um, yeah, it's going to be a very different Christmas for I think many people, but we'll find a way through. We always do. If you look for a way, it may not be the way that you want it, but at least it's a way. But yeah, difficult times, but we'll be all right. Been through worse, really, haven't we? But what do you think? I'll just, I'll just dip in now. Let's just dip. I'm doing this now. I wasn't going to do this, but apparently I'm doing this and carving in the bunny. I like it. Actually, now I'm going over it. That That's picking up a little bit there. Maybe it wasn't quite dry, but you can paint over it quite well. I'm uh, I'm enjoying the colour. I'm quite enjoying the texture. It does seem just incredibly dark, uh, uh, watery, which a problem but different when I did that I actually meant to dip it in water oh well just to get this a bit more and it's actually easier I guess because it is so watery it's easier to move about generally if I had done that with say India ink and then gone over here like even this this would have dried and it really would be a whole thing to try and move it at all but that's that's pretty good actually you can do this bit and then come back to this bit Ooh, no water and move it all about a bit which i think is good yeah what time is it i must remember i've actually got work in a minute about 20 minutes please remember please i don't know work don't know if getting in the way of what you want to do doesn't it i enjoy my job so i'm a therapist if anyone's interested and i haven't mentioned it before but i am actually quite a sensible therapist believe it or not and I need to be but anyway I am quite enjoying this where did it is where did it go oh my look what's what's what it's this one isn't it yes okay <laughs> try and color in the right the right one but okay I like this I haven't used the other things I'll quickly swatch them out so you see what they were like and then I should be getting actually getting the next palette for box which is November's one I think uh, in the next couple of days because obviously being in England it takes it takes a lot longer to get to us than it does uh, America although we get scroller box sooner so swings and roundabouts I suppose let's try a bit more thicker I think that's as dark as we can get I like this stuff actually it's very scratchy on here how is it on here just quick oh, move before I bring you ruin you bless um it goes nicely on this like this this might actually be drying a bit quicker let's do same as we did on the ear just along the ear and see if we can come back to it with a bit of water see if it dries quick uh, quicker so i'm thinking yes can you see it's harder to move it about it's still doing it and it's actually a lot better but there see how it's harder to get the line still better than than India ink which I think does dry a lot better uh, better quicker well he's um kind of lost his face but he's fine but yeah, there you go very very quick one we'll just go through these things we have oh walnut brown <laughs> this is the water one so maybe if I color in a few little areas his uh, his neck got a lot um thicker than i meant definitely thicker than i meant what if we color in this arm just try and give that a bit of difference and then bring in our paintbrush mm, not, not. i mean it doesn't say it's water soluble but it has the little paintbrush on it. Let's have a quick read. Yep, there you go. Can you see? Watercolour pencil. So it should work well with water. And they have before, but again, this paper is a lot different to use. I'm making his neck thicker now, aren't I? Kind of. There you go. Yeah, it's not moving as well as I'd like. So that is an issue. I wish I made his head bigger as well. But we can always change things on another picture. So there's that one. 
and then what else did we get we got the faber castell uh this is these are watercolor don't they let's have another look maybe that's on there modern drawing brush uh blah, blah, blah. Uh, uh india ink right so this is filled with india ink so we can just give them a bit more outline a little something something and this should react with water i guess a little fluff a little evil evil fluff that's what we want it's in life in general a bit of evil fluff He's lost his um lost his uh, arms a little bit doing that, but there you go, you can always get him back. So nice colours again, walnut brown, yes, everything is walnut brown. I like a bit of walnut brown apparently. I'm quite happy with this box. Now, I wish I'd sort of I think I got it I I got it either the tail end of, of um, Inktober or maybe even beginning of November, to be honest. I didn't get it long ago, but yeah, things are difficult right now being delivered and stuff. But did we, what else did we get? Oh, we got the other pencil, which is not water soluble, but is a pencil. So I like using pencil over the top of um, watercolours actually and inks as well just to give it a bit more definition a bit of shading texture is that the word I'm looking for there's a little more texture let's give him some killer cheekbones with his little little tiny face go oh, keep an eye on the side on the tie or I will be in trouble all right Okay, there we go. That will do my my terrible attempt at drawing and inking, whatever it is I'm doing. But anyway, there you go. That was your palette full pack for October. A nice, a nice pack. I enjoyed that. Do not leave that in a uh, water, Sam. Let's see if we can get this lid on without completely making a mess. How about that for an idea? Eek. Possibly, possibly. A little bit on my desk, but it's fine. It's fine. I can use little, this little guy. I never noticed the difference between nibs, so there's that. But anyway, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Me attempting an evil bunny and... Well, he's different looking. Oh, I missed half of his body. That's possibly why he's so grumpy. There, it's fine, it's fine. But anyway, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Please like and subscribe if you would like. It would be absolutely awesome and make my day. But don't, you know, don't feel obliged at all. But, you know, it'd be nice. But anyway, I will see you next time for whatever it is I'm going to be getting up to. Yeah. Bye.